let's look at Roxanne. I mean, you, you guys have been around in the same circles, you know, mm -hmm. fighting for the same leagues for a long time. She took a fight card from one of the judges when she fought Maya in her title fight. Easily still a top contender mm -hmm. at 125. Of you're course. Com you, you, you fought since your Invicta fight here, but you're still, you know, coming off that win in, yeah. in this promotion mm -hmm. over Andrea Lee. Uh, I've got to believe that you're right there in the mix for a potential title fight if you get this win. Are you, I believe so. Are you, have I've you been told so. I mean, I've wanted it for a long time. Years. Yeah. I'm not even kidding. Years. Yeah. I've wanted that belt. So it would mean a lot. Years of hard work, like, finally. Sure. Finally happening. 125.7 for Mata Ferry. You know what? I always wonder what my opponent's game plans are against me. Like, how would they fight me? I don't know how to fight me. I'm confused. I confuse myself sometimes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, I can tell you that I don't want to be, like, getting pound, ground and pound underneath sure. her right. on yeah, the ground. Yeah, yeah. So anything but that would probably be good. Um, I'm going to be opportunistic, you know? We'll see where the fight goes. I think it'll be, it could go anywhere, really. I'll do what's necessary to become the champion. Out of the evening, three rounds. This scheduled in the flyweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, fighting out of Dublin, California. Here is Sarah, the monster, Delania. And her opponent across the cage. She fights out of Las Vegas, Nevada. Here is Roxanne, Happy Warrior, Monafer. get in the cage, the doors close, the referee asks you, are you ready? Do you ever get lost in the moment going, oh my goodness, it's time to fight? When the ref says ready, I think, finally, let's do this. Oh, hard right here by Delalio. Montefiore on the run, in trouble. Roxanne's trying to recover here. It looks like she's, you know, she's back in the fight. She's got her feet up her again. Ferry helped back to her corner a little bit. I don't know if she was a bit woozy or if the corner member was just helping her. I mean, she, she, she got spiked right on her head. She did, and she also was dropped earlier in the round. However, she put it right back there. Frustrated as she gets to her feet, entering this final frame. Mata Ferry, I think, has stolen some of the momentum here. I'm super excited about this fight right now. It is all on the line here. Final five minutes between Roxanne Mata Ferry and Sarah Dahlia.
And Roxanne Monteferi made a huge statement. Referee Mike England puts a halt to this bout. Your winner by TKO, Roxanne. Happy Warrior, Monteferi! Oh, we talk about the personalities that make up mixed martial arts. She's a true martial artist. Daly, you had a lot of respect for Roxanne coming in to this fight. We talk about how the, there's title implications for this. This fight has a lot to do about legacy as well. I mean, both fighters have been around for a very long time. Who knows if they ever get to go again inside the cage, so. Yeah, and you know, I have to say, I am continually impressed by the Roxanne Mataferi evolution. Like, that was an aggressive fight where she put her in danger on her feet. Do you think that that's why she dressed up as the Red Ranger, that she was feeling a little sharky tonight? Yeah! Oh, awesome. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I said you got the best chin in the business, too. You're the best. I told you. Morphin time. That was the US. You, Roxy. Different. This way. Punches were really super hard. I think the first punch sent me into the next day. <laughs> it's really awesome to feel everybody's positive energy. I'm very grateful. I'm the happy warrior, and it's because I think positively, but also I get a lot of positive support from everybody. So that's awesome. Put a couple hands in there. Two steps. Third round, she's in her punch like this. You couldn't, you could take care of her that. Imagine that on your record. Imagine that on your record. Yeah. She could have the last one too, but she won't let me have it. She won't let me have it. <laughs> I'm, I'm, fe I'm feeling more and more confident with my striking. You know, I, my, my right hand's getting better. Um, I'm really excited that I dropped her with my striking. It's a big accomplishment for me. Um, man, I've come so far in my career. You know, a lot of people have seen me on The Ultimate Fighter and then really haven't followed me since then, but I'm such a different fighter. I'm, I'm just so excited to keep progressing, you know? It's awesome. Uh, I have so much stuff on my plate coming up. I'm trying to take things one, one, one step at a time. Uh, I'm not really sure what's next, but we'll see. It's going to be good. I'm not even close to being over. I'm not close to being over. That made sense. <laughs> <laughs>